Um, anyways, what else? What else did I want to talk about? Oh, did you guys watch all the Mayweather um, McGregor pressers, as they call them overseas, the press conferences? It was kind of the same thing over and over again. With Conor McGregor, he just kept going like, what the fuck? What the fuck is wrong with you? He's got on a fucking tracksuit. <laughs> that form Voltron thing was dumb, and I loved when he trashed him on that. But I will tell you this. Watching all of those people showing up for a fucking press conference, they sold out the Barclays Center. They sold out where, like, the Maple Leafs play, I believe, in Toronto. The Staples Center, people showing up to watch a fucking press conference. I can tell you this. Oh, cynical Bill's going to ruin the pay-per-view for you. Those press conferences are going to be better than the fight. You know, and the fucking people that are going to order that goddamn fight are the same fucking people that slow down on the highway to watch somebody change a fucking tire. Um, it, it's like, it's just beyond... It's beyond a spectacle. And hey, people go like, hey, you know, I know it's a spectacle, but, you know, I'm just, I'm just going to watch it to fucking watch it. Um, yeah, I know I'm getting fucked in the ass, but uh, I want to see what it feels like. <laughs> Dude, that pay-per-view can go fuck itself. Dude, they're riding on the same plane over to fucking London. Get the fuck out of here. And all the shit McGregor gives Mayweather, there's one topic he completely avoids because it would fuck with ticket sales, which kind of makes him part of the fucking bullshit of that whole thing. You know what I mean? It's just get the fuck out of here. I'm not, I give, I've given that guy enough fucking goddamn money. Given him enough fucking money. I've gotten fucked enough. I've gotten fucked enough by that guy. Where, like, it's professional boxers can't lay a fucking hand on him, and I'm, I'm fucking nodding off by the eighth round. As he's poo 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 pointing him to fucking death. Um, now he's going to fight a guy who's not even a box, who used to box. I love that. Hey, used to box. Yeah. There's a lot of people used to do stand up. You want to see them do an HBO special? Um, here's the bottom line if they ever met each other in a bar and started swinging, McGregor would fucking kill him. He'd take him to the ground, and then Mayweather wouldn't know what to do. So they've eliminated all of that. We know, Bill. You've said that. So I don't know. Um, anyways, maybe McGregor's, I mean, Mayweather's ego, maybe he tries to knock him out. I'm just not, I'm not going to fucking watch it. I'm really not. I, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get out on the highway when the fucking fight is on and just cruise down the highway doing 90 miles an hour, just looking around going like, this is what it should be like. Like if I was running shit, this would be the level of people that were in the world. I was joking on my, uh, this weekend in, uh, Grand Rapids saying, you know what I would do if I was running shit on the night? of the Mayweather McGregor fight, I would turn all the Buffalo Wild Wings into gas chambers. <laughs> all those fucking mouth breathing morons that wear jerseys, you know, with other men's names on the back. All day, all day, do what I say, do what I called it. All of those guys just, you just gone. All of them gone. And you'd watch. I bet, I bet the, the mean, the level of meanness on, on, on the internet would go down. You know? These, I, by the way, these fucking people now who just sit there and they watch CNN or Fox all day long and then they show up to you and they just start vomiting out all this fucking fearful shit that they just watched. And then after they do that and get you all stirred up, they don't even have the decency to offer a fucking solution. All these fucking morons. It's just like, why would you sit there and watch Fox News all day? That's all you're going to do? Watch a little CNN. Balance out your fucking lies. Keep yourself level. Fucking what's his face? My buddy was telling me this weekend, you know, it's going to global warming is going to get so hot. You know, they're saying they're not going to be able to fly planes out of LaGuardia. And I'm and immediately I'm thinking like, oh, how the fuck am I going to be a comedian anymore? You know, and then that was it. He didn't offer any fucking solutions. He just let me know like, hey, in the future, you're not going to be able to do your job. And then I'm starting to fucking think about, you know, me and my family living out in the street. All I want to do is just, I just want to play a little asteroids. You know? If you don't have a fucking solution, don't bring up the goddamn problem. Okay? Like I brought up the Conor McGregor Mayweather. All right? I said it's a fucking problem. I gave you your solution. You drive on the highway 90 miles an hour and you turn the Buffalo Wild Wings into a gas chamber. See that? See that? I'm a good guy. Everybody else is an idiot. In my world... 
I'm the smartest person in the room. Sorry. Well, what do you want? What the fuck do you want from me? You know, 